What the fuck is a synthetic CDO? Well, here's Dr. Richard Thaler, father of behavioral economics, and Selena Gomez to explain. Okay, so here's how a synthetic CDO works. Let's say I bet 10 million on a blackjack hand. 10 million because this hand is meant to represent a single mortgage bond. Okay, Selena has a pretty good hand here, showing 18, dealer showing seven. That's a really good hand for Selena. Good odds. In fact, her chances of winning this hand are 87%. So, my odds are good. I'm on a winning streak. Everybody in this place wants to get in on the action. How could I lose, right? Now, this is a classic error. In basketball, it's called the hot hand fallacy. A player makes a bunch of shots in a row. People are sure they're gonna make the next one. People think whatever's happening now is gonna continue to happen into the future. During the real estate boom, markets were going up and up, and people thought they would never go down. So people who are watching and think that I won't lose will make a side bet. Now this is the first synthetic CD. I love Selena Gomez. I bet you 50 million she wins. And I'll give you a three to one odds. Three to one odds? Okay, I'll take that bet. Now, Somebody else is going to want to make a bet on the outcome of their Actually, bet. 50 million she wins. That will lead to synthetic CDO number two. Hey, I bet you 200 million that lady in the glasses wins that bet. She probably will win. So I want a great payoff. How about 20 to 1? Deal. And this will go on and on with more and more synthetic CDOs. And we can transform an original $10 million investment into billions of dollars.